So before 2022 is over and we all start talking about how bad 2022 was, I personally want to say that 2022 for me and my family was an absolute blessing. We had amazing things that happened through happened to us throughout the year. Was every day perfect? Absolutely no. Um, but we had fun as a family. We learned a lot. We ate good food. We went places. We saw things. We did things. We had the opportunity to travel cross country. Uh, 2022, we got to see Oklahoma, Texas, New Mexico, Arizona, Nevada. We got to have family come visit us. We also got to go visit family. Um, we joined the gym. I got in the best shape of my life. Um, went viral a couple of times on TikTok. That wasn't half bad. Um, I got to watch my daughters grow. My daughter made it on the news with her business. Um, my husband and I, we bonded like never before. We continued to eat good food. 2022 was just filled with blessings on top of blessings. Um, it was prosperous. It, it was profitable for all of us. Um, we grew in ways that we didn't know that we could grow. Um, we've been away from home for two years now. Uh, since moving to Texas and things have been good and things are going to get better. 2023 is just going to be an absolute better version of 2022. So I want more of these picnics, more of these moments with my family, with my children. I'm forever grateful for all the experiences that we had this year. Um, and I'm looking forward to everything else that is to come looking to have as much fun as possible, make as many memories as possible, and just become the best versions of ourselves that we have ever been. 2022 showed that peace is definitely something that you cannot buy. It is something you cannot fake. It is something you either have or you don't, but you are in control of your happiness, your peace. You have to decide what lengths you're willing to go to to protect that. Um, and 2022 offered so much peace, but more clarity than anything that will allow us to make better decisions moving forward to protect that peace. So just take this as your sign to get out the house in 2023. Go see stuff, go do stuff, no matter how little. Just go make those memories. If the pandemic didn't teach us anything, um, time with family, loving those, uh, becoming a better you, there are things that we just need to prioritize. Um, 2023, we're going to move forward. We're not going to look backwards. Um, we're going to we're going to become the best versions of ourselves. And I know people say that every year, but just take this as your, time, your sign to, to do something different or follow your dreams or do something you've always wanted to do. Just do something different in 2023. Stop repeating the same cycle. We wish you all health and wealth and prosperity uh, moving forward into the new year. Love you all. Be good. Be safe. This New Year's uh, Eve. Kiss your loved ones. Tell them that you love them. Say it out loud.